this was my server, and now it's gone. This all happened because of one single button. You see, one month ago, SasquatchMC was doing well. However, that would change soon, as just a few days later, the server began its descent into lies, corruption, and demotivation. On November the 25th, while streaming the finale of Sasquatch MC, the server began to lag. Eventually, Sasquatch MC couldn't handle all of the players who were online at the time, and the server crashed. But, why? Well, just one week before that, I noticed everyone was leaving the game and not being able to talk. I had my suspects for what the cause for this was, however, I couldn't be too sure as I had to resolve a conflict. You see, some players, including me, wanted to flood spawn so that we could rebuild the island at spawn. However, literally everyone was against my team. Well, I guess, here goes nothing. No, I, I just died, oh my gosh. Even though I just lost one of the most important fights on the server, I had to keep investigating why my server died. Two weeks ago, someone who claimed to be a friend's friend joined my server. However, what I didn't know about them is that they had access to my server files. This meant that they could do whatever they wanted, including bypassing all forms of punishment. Unfortunately, they were power hungry, so they started spamming random letters in Sasquatch MC. And after I muted them, it didn't help whatsoever, as they simply unmuted themselves and continued spamming in chat. How could they get access to my files? And why couldn't I remove their access? Well, that really didn't help me at the time, because I was suddenly discouraged, as they could simply modify anything in my server files at the time, and I would have no idea. I felt excluded from Sasquatch MC at this point, so I simply logged out for a few weeks, feeling demotivated. However, when I was messing around with my settings, I accidentally hit edit on Sasquatch MC. When the server IP pops up, I realized something. Quickly, I scrolled through my DMs, and slowly, I pieced together the story. You see, this all started one month ago, when I got a message from one of my friends, 58 Tech Boy, who offered to run Sasquatch MC for free. Letting my greed take me over, and knowing that I could get a free server, I quickly transferred the files. With a single press of a button, I had started a revolution. When his friend who had panel access started spamming, I got demotivated and quit the server for a few weeks. In that time, the server evolved into anarchy. And while I was gone, massive wars occurred, leaving players wanting to quit and leave the server forever. I couldn't take it anymore, so I left again to work on a fourth season of Sasquatch MC. Finally, the new season was complete, and this time, I moved back to my original hosting service. However, before I could open Sasquatch MC Season 4, I had to stream the finale of Season 3. Uh, yeah, it kind of crashed because Tech Boy servers couldn't handle 14 players online. <laughs> hey, at least I flooded the island halfway. 